What's up, everybody? It's Jay from Jay Mini Scale Garage coming at you. Kind of with a bench update and a couple new stash ads. Uh, I would turn the camera around, but the table's a mess. I got the car for Senior. I got it mocked up. Everything's been fitting pretty good together. I got the second little coat of primer on it. As y'all know, it's cold outside. So I can't spray no primer in the house because the wife's got out her allergics. Allergies. So I had to wait on that part. But no problem. So first of all, let's do the stashes. I went to the hobby store or the hobby shop today, picked up a couple of these. Got a couple of these. New Corrals, I heard they're um what do you call it? Curbside, I guess. But that's alright, it'll blend in with the rest of them I got. Um Yeah, let's open one up, find out. Hope everybody's doing good out there. Staying warm in this crazy cold weather. It's been cold and snowing here all morning. Actually, all day. It's still snowing outside. That's crazy. All right, now we got our glass T tops. I don't know if, they, if it molds. Oh, mine has a belt on it or the band in the middle. It goes right through the T-tops on the frame. There we go. Frame. Let me see something here. I can tell I ain't going to like the tires on this one. Good looking frame though. Front end, back end, hood. Take the hood off real quick. <laughs> we'll see how it looks. Like I said, hope everybody's staying warm out there. Cheers and people. Doing what they had to do. I figured it was cold. I'm staying and drinking me a beer. He's supposed to, but I'm tired of hearing them doctor's bullshits. All right, hood fits pretty good. The hell's in big pieces. Hood fits it pretty good. Pretty nice, actually. It's got a little flash on the front of it right there. We'll have to cut that off and uh, see what that shit's all about. Um, there's your stock wheels. And like I said, I ain't gonna like these wheels. They're two piece. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Let me get them cut open here. There it is. They put so much tape on the shit anymore, it's hard to just bust it open. There we go. I'll show you the wheels. Here's the wheels. 
They're two piece plastic. They're GT radios. And all you have to do is paint them black and white, sand that the letters off and have white letters. Oh, and it's also got the radiator hose mounted already. Um, here is the engine. We should do that at the top of it halfway decent. And a breather. Here is the chassis. But underneath it don't look bad at all. I mean, for having a motor motor in. It's got duels and everything on it. Here's the fan blade. There's the back of the wheels. I said that's the only thing I'm not going to like about it. Steering wheel, shifter. If I have to, I'll get some uh, aftermarket tires and wheels. <laughs> they even got the damn exhaust tips mounted to the rear end. I don't know how that's going to work. I might just cut them off and make my own exhaust. Interior tub don't look too bad. The front end is all just one piece. Right there's the front end. There's the interior tub. My interior tub don't look too bad. Front seats. At least they gave the Camaro the high backs with the, the back seat or the back of the cover seats. Put these back in there. The instructions. Gotta have instructions. And the decals. Whoa. That's some nice looking decals. We got decal for the taillights. You got three different sets of stripes, it looks like. Yeah, one, two, actually four. Four sets of Z Z28 stripes. I might just have a buddy of mine. <laughs> Paint that body in candy orange. I'm not for sure. Here's the instructions. It's like opening a damn newspaper. Oh, it's two pieces now. All right. Not too much on instructions on know-how. Oh, got that backward. Got it backwards, colors. There we go. I'm gonna call a buddy of mine up and see if he wants to paint a body for me. I'd love to have like a candy yellow or a candy orange. That's all we got for that. That one, anyways. I said the body don't look bad at all. Sit that under there. The glass right there. Okay, like I said, I got two of those. There's the other one. And then I also got the new 
release of the 62 Impala convertible, which I might be making a low rider out of this one. Make it like old big worms up on a smoking in there. that movie. Friday, next Friday, that's it, next Friday. Host, no, no ice cream man, no the worm. I'm gonna make that on there for his. All right, we're at 10 minutes already. Let me get this the car shown to you guys. All right, now I got this car mocked up. Everything's fitting good. I mean, knock on wood. I gotta do a little bit of sanding on the body. I put two coats of primer on it. Rolls perfect. It ain't got no weeble wobble in the wheels. Uh, let me turn this around and I'll show you. If I can't turn around, I'll just pop another video on. So hold on. Give me just a minute. All right, fellas. Now to start the video over. Let me get some of this stuff put up out of the way. I had everybody want me to put the crackers on it. So I got the crackers on it. Like I said, I got them mocked up. The only thing I don't like, man, is glass is like green tinted, so. I don't know about that. It looks bluish, but it's like a, a light green. I'll figure it out later. Check it out. There she is. Front end says kind of high. I can't lower the front end no more because with the wheelbase, right up here at the top of the fender wheel, you don't have no room to cut that down to move it. Unless, hey, wait a minute. Unless I cut out the wheel wheels. I could knock the wheels out and try to raise the front end up a little bit. I never thought about that because you can't see it. You can't open the hood. Uh, you got the roll bar in it. Interior's all done. Got the CB in it. I go and combine both cars together. I said it's called white interior now, which that'll be tan. The body, I etched these lines out a little bit more. Which I need to clean that one out from where I was just sanding on it. You see that back in the back? Run's gone. Back bumper fits really nice. Like I said, it's just sitting on there. It's I glue all my parts, so everything's just sitting on there. Front end looks really good. You got the grills in there. It comes with optional. You can bust a couple holes in here and put your roll bar on the front. I don't think I'm going to do that. I think I'm do, it's, like it's got the roll bar in the interior. Which... That'll get glued down, but it's kind of cool. Crackers fit good. They roll. No, they roll. And it got no wobble. No three wheel motion on it. So, that's that. And then, whoop, bam. Got some interior done. Or some exterior. Listen to me. Some damn exterior done. Maltol chromed all this. Everything on here has been Maltol chrome. Now I'm going to flat clear this bottom. When I do, all this is going to look like a steel. I'll probably end up doing that tomorrow. Got it all the way out to the tips. Which the only thing I have to do, I even did the top of the springs right here. I wish they had that rear end out some more. So you can actually take and drop these down this way. To make it go this way. In the rake situation. As you can tell, I got the door handles is gone. All the marker lights are gone. I'm talking about all of them. Gone. Gone. Door handles gone. But anyway, back to the bottom. Sorry guys, I had a brain fart. But I did all the holes, bolts, everything on it. I even kind of... 
trim those out a little bit. But there she is for the senior build. She is mocked up. You see, you raise the bottom up a little bit. And the chassis drops down just a tad, but it raises the rear end up. But when you sit down and glue everything in, she's going to be tucked down. Front set, front solid. It ain't going no farther. Uh, but yeah, there she is. All mocked up for the senior tribute build. Damn. Glass mood. So, all right, guys. It's been enough time on here. So this is Jay from Jay Me Sell Garage. Thank you for the past, present, and future subscribers. Um, I ain't, I kind of figured out the color on it, but I'm going to leave it a surprise. The next one will be the interior be in color. The bottom will be flat colored or flat cleared. Interior be done, flat cleared. Then I'll have the body color. And I'll do another video, one more video before I put it all together. Um, I got to get a hold of them and get some decals. For the ones that says kiss my ass. Um, and then I'll be done with her. So. Yeah. This is Jay from Jay Meeskill. I hope everybody stays warm. And I'm out.